Hello you guys, what is up? So for today's video, we're going to be cleaning my room. It is currently cleaned already because I'm filming this at the end of the video. It was disgusting before, like it was literally disgusting. And I honestly don't even know how my room gets that messy. I tell myself every single year or every single month, like, oh, I'm going to keep my room clean. I'm going to do it. We're not going to let it get messy again. I do this every time I clean it. And guess what happens? I just get messy. And I don't know how. It's almost like there's little trolls in my room throwing clothes everywhere, but it's just me. And sometimes I literally do it subconsciously and I don't even realize that I'm making a mess And then I walk in my room and I'm like, what the hell? How did it get so messy? But it's it's me. It's me who makes it that messy So here's my beautiful clean room Here we go. The closet doesn't get any better Do not judge me, okay? I know you guys have messy rooms as well So we're in this together If you guys are watching this video or after you watch it, go and clean your room <coughs> For all of us to do this together Okay, I think what I'm going to start by doing is picking up all of the clothing on the floor just because that is what's making it so cluttered. If the clothing wasn't on the floor, it wouldn't be that bad. I literally just take something off and throw it on the floor because usually when I get undressed, it's before I go to bed and I'm just so exhausted that like I'll just rip it off, put it on the floor. I'm like, I'll clean it up tomorrow and then I never do it. And that's how it happens. So yeah, I'm going to set the camera up here and we'll do a little bit of a time lapse and then I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. All right, it's time to clean this disgusting pig of a room. I'm gonna put some tunes on first though. Hey, when it come to you, two, So now we got this area cleaned and now we're gonna move on kind of here because I just have really random stuff there. So I literally just have a Dunkin' Donuts bag with like craft supplies in it that I need to bring down. And then I just bought some, I bought some organizers today from the other store. So I'm gonna be placing these in today. I'm gonna show you guys what I do with them. And then my old duvet covers that I need to put somewhere or throw out. Bring that out of the room, bring that, bring that. Just get rid of this shit because I don't know why it's still in my room. See, that's my problem. I keep stuff in my room when I should have just taken them out a few weeks ago, you know what I mean? So it just accumulates and it's bad and it just, just needs to stop happening. Ooh. Oh, okay. So I just got the box for the Christmas tree and we're gonna sadly put that away. I'm not really sure how it goes in. I think I'm gonna have to like break it into two pieces, but we will see. And then I'm just gonna store this underneath my bed, I guess, for the rest of the year. So I've never really put a tree back in a case before. So I guess you have to like put the branches like up so that it fits, you know what I mean? I really enjoyed this tree though. This was my favorite Christmas tree that I've ever had in my room. And I just can't wait to bring it out again next year. It's from Walmart, by the way, if you guys are curious. And it was only $40, which is like really good because it's really cute. I'm kind of forcing this in here, but I don't really, I didn't take it out of the box. Joel took it out of the box for me. So I don't really know how it came, you know? So I'm trying my best over here. I'm gonna also try and see if I can fit the skirt that I have for it in here because that would save space. Okay, fits. I'm just gonna have to tape it down like that so that it actually stays. Okay, you know that's kind of shitty, but it's gonna have to do for now. Okay, so now I'm gonna have to put the tree back underneath the bed. Okay, so as you can see, my desk is a complete disaster, so we need to fix this. It just has a whole bunch of random stuff in it that have different places. I have some Christmas decorations, and it just all needs to go, and it needs to be clean space, Windexed space, and we're going to make that happen. So, let's get cleaning. Now that it is all cleaned off, I'm going to wipe it down. I couldn't find a hand towel, so I got this big ass towel, so we're just gonna have to work with it. Um, I got some Windex, and we're gonna make it look clean and better and not disgusting. Okay, let's do it. Does that not look 
1 million times better. Okay, so I got this Ikea unit for Christmas and I haven't finished filling out all the drawers yet. And I really wanted to make this drawer a jewelry drawer because I don't really want like a jewelry box because I feel like this is literally the perfect spot to have my jewelry. And I've never seen anyone do this before, but I just kind of thought of it and I'm like, that's a really good idea. So I bought organizers from the dollar store and I'm gonna put them in here and then see if they fit. I don't have much jewelry. I really wanna grow my jewelry collection, but with the jewelry that I do have, um, we'll see if it fits in here. Oh my goodness, shut up. They're literally a perfect fit. Look at that. It like just skims the top. So I got like a whole bunch. Oh my god, I hate when things have tags and they like stick on. That's the worst. No. I literally hate when it feels like that. Like, can you just peel off correctly so that it looks nice? Okay, so I got the organizers in and they fit literally perfectly. So I'm gonna put my jewelry in here, organize it, and then I'll show you guys what it looks like. Alright, so I finished the drawer. Doesn't that literally work perfectly? I don't have much as you can see, but the little things that I have, it fits it really nicely. And then in the middle here, I just have bags in case I want to bring my jewelry anywhere so I can store it in these bags. And then yeah, so I got my rings, necklace, my silver necklaces, earrings, necklaces, random bracelets. These are anklets and then just a silver bracelet. But yeah, I think that this is like such a good way to have your jewelry, honestly. I always see people organizing these Alex 9 drawers with makeup, but maybe I'm changing the game here because this is such a good way to store your jewelry. Am I right or am I right? Voila, there we go. Okay, so now I have a little bit of a mess in this corner. These are my two Christmas pillows and then I have just like random socks and shit. So we're gonna do a little bit of clean out of this area. Okay, so now we're gonna be doing my bed. I mean, I never really fully do my bed to be completely honest because my cat really likes to sleep in it during the day. So I kind of leave it a little bit undone if that makes sense. So we're just gonna kind of just make it look better than it looks right now. All right, that looks so much better. I'm just gonna leave the pillows here because my cat likes to sleep like in the sheets, like there. Or there so we don't want pillows interrupting her little naps during the day okay so now we're gonna do the closet it's not really that messy I just kind of have a few things on the ground I'm just like really contemplating I don't know where to keep my laundry basket I don't like the way that it looks just in my room so I might just hide it in the closet I also Ooh. I also have this weight in here that I use for working out. There's not really anywhere to put it. I guess I can tuck it in a little bit here, but uh, that's about it. That's about all I can do here. Actually, there is kind of a lot of things on the floor. Yikes. Okay, so this is as good as the closet's gonna get. I honestly don't think it looks that bad with the laundry bin on the side. The only thing is that like it hinders drawers here so I won't be able to open them. But I can always just move it when I wanna open them. It's not a big deal. I think this is the best place for it because it hides it and looks sleek, it's fine. And then you just shut the closet doors and you can't see anything, so it's perfect. Now, I just have my garbage to unload and then that's pretty much honestly it. We did really well, you guys. So I think I'm gonna move my garbage kind of beside here. It was lost for a bit and didn't have a home. So I put the garbage here because I feel like it hides it, you know what I mean? So it's not visible because you don't want garbages to be visible. So I feel like behind the desk is a perfect hiding spot. Plus I feel like when I'm at the desk is when I'm gonna have the most things to throw out. So it's perfect. Okay, one thing I forgot to do is vacuum. So we're gonna do that right now. It's gonna be really satisfying. Maybe for me, cause I don't think the camera's gonna pick up every little speck of hair on the floor, but it needs to be done. So we're gonna do that now. sun came out today it's been raining for literally not even joking you a month straight so seeing the sun is like thank you like thank you finally all right you guys so that was the end of today's video i really hoped you enjoyed it please leave any video requests down below because that helps me a lot to know what you guys want to see it feels so good to clean literally like a soul rejuvenation i feel like what i'm gonna do from now on is 
every single night before I go to bed, I'm just gonna put a 10 minute timer on my phone. And in that 10 minutes, I'm just gonna clean. So whether it be Windexing, whether it be picking up my clothes off the floor from that day, whether it be just tidying, organizing or whatever, for that 10 minutes every night, I'm gonna start to clean so that my room will never get messy again. Because I think that's a really good strategy because then it's like, it's just 10 minutes. You can even do five minutes. And it's just such a small amount of time that if you put in that little time every single day, then you're also gonna have a clean space. And waking up to a clean space is so much fresher and just better. Like when I wake up in my room as a mess, it almost puts like a weight on me and it's like, ew, I need to stop. You guys can hold me to it. I don't know if I'm actually gonna stick to it. I mean, I really hope I do, but I'm gonna make that a goal. So <laughs> anyways, so that was today's video. I really hoped you guys liked it and enjoyed cleaning with me. Yeah, I love you guys so much. Peace out. I'll see you in my next video.